Hey guys, we're going to do another quick video real quick. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use our Zapier integration to basically sync up with any platform that you're using and get leads from almost anywhere. So to do that, I'm first going to go in and create a new list real quick just for this demo. So I'm going to create a new list called Zapier Demo. So I've created this new list called Zapier Demo. So now I'm just going to go ahead and find this list real quick and load this list up. And then I'm going to go ahead and jump over here to Zapier and I'm going to make a new Zap. So I'm just going to go ahead and use this Google Sheets here just for the Zapier Demo. So here's Google Sheets. So I'm going to go in and pick this. I'm going to pick this account that I have set up already. And then I'm going to pick a spreadsheet. It's going to be called Zap Test. And then I'm going to use a new lead worksheet. And I'm only going to do this whenever the message column gets updated, which is this last column right here. So I'm going to fetch and continue. So now I'm going to go in and I'm going to choose my action. And this is going to be our application. So we're just going to go in and pick our application. And you can see we have two different actions that we can do here. We can either sync our leads and basically add them to a list or we can send out an SMS, whichever you want to do. And we're going to add a couple more actions here. If you guys ask us to, you know, we pretty much build anything that you ask us for. So right now, let's just look at this sync leads and then we'll look at this SMS as a next action. So now I'm going to go in and I need to use this guy right here. So this is really easy to connect. To connect, you just need to go in and put in an API key. You're going to get that API key just by coming in here to your settings. If you come to your settings, you'll see that you have this API. You can go in and create a new API key. You can see I've already created an API token called Zap. I've got that token. And then all I did was hit connect account. And I put that token in here and connected that account. So that account's already connected. So I'm going to go in and save and continue. So now I'm presented with this screen where I can go in and pick the list that I want to sync this to. So remember that list we just created, that Zapier demo? I'm going to use that. Do you want to add these guys to a campaign that you have currently? If you want to go ahead and add somebody to a campaign, you can go ahead and just automatically add them to one of your campaigns. This is optional. As you can see, it's optional. This one's required. So I'm not going to give a campaign because I don't want to add these guys to any campaign. So now I need to put a name. What's this guy's name? So I'm going to put their name in here from the first step. Now, I also need to give their email, which is also optional. So I'm going to take my email from my first step. And then I need a phone number. So I'm going to put in the phone number from the first step. So I'm going to continue. That's all done. So I'm going to create and continue. And then we're going to go ahead and add one new action. We're going to add another step, which is also going to be from our application. And we're going to do the send SMS. So now we're going to send this SMS. I'm going to authenticate the same account here. So now we can go in and pick that same from. This is one of our phone numbers. So these are your phone numbers inside this account here. So I'm going to go in and pick this phone number right here. So who am I going to send this to? I'm going to send this to this phone number here. So I'm going to send this out to this phone number. And what's going to be the body? Well, this body is going to be this message coming from this sheet right here. So now that's all set up. And I'm going to create and continue. This is done. So I'm going to finish this up. This is Zap demo for video. And I'm going to go ahead and turn this on. So now I'm going to see this in my dashboard. And Zap here. Just going to see this in my Zap. So here's this guy right here. I'm actually going to go ahead and delete this guy here. Really delete. I'm also going to go ahead and delete this guy here. These are previous tests that I've done. So I'm going to delete those guys there. And then I'm going to make sure that I don't have anybody else here. I don't have anybody else there. So now I've got this zap that I've just created right here. So now what I'm going to do 
is I'm going to add in a Zapier demo. It's going to be this guy's name, Zapier at demo.com. His phone number is going to be 812-820-7666 is going to be his phone number. And here is some message that I want to send this user. So now that's all done. So now I'm going to come right back over here to Zapier since I've updated that. Now, remember, this will run automatically every 15 minutes. This will run according to um, the action. And this is the Google Spreadsheets, which is the action. So I'm just going to manually cause this to run. And I can see that it's just triggered on one of these guys. So now let's go back here to this list and take a look at this list. And I can see here is that Zapier demo. So this is from when I actually set up Zapier, whenever I just set that up and ever it asked me to test the steps. This came from testing the steps. This is the live demo that you just watched me set in. And if I look at this guy, you can see that this guy already has a text message that's been sent out from him. Here's the message that I want to send to this user that came from this spreadsheet here. So that's how you use the Zapier integration. And with that Zapier integration, like I said, you can go in and you can add somebody you can add somebody to a campaign, you can add somebody to your list, you can send out a text message. So another cool integration that I'll show you is if you look here at this mini chat leads, this is another Zapier integration that happens. I'll show you this is done right here and this is done right here. So with this integration right here, I'm syncing this up. If you look, I'm syncing this up to mini chat leads. So, and I'm also going to put this guy on this uh, on no campaign. So now you can see what's going to happen is if you go to Facebook and you go to this page right here where I have this mini chat connected. And if you were to come to this page right here and come to this page and send me out a message. So let's just delete this current message. So now I'm just going to come to this mini chat leads and you can see I'm going to go ahead and delete most of these guys. I'm going to leave that guy. I'm going to leave that guy, leave that guy, leave that guy, leave that guy. And I'm going to leave that guy. I'm going to delete all those John Vaughn. So So I've deleted those guys out. So now I'm going to come back here to mini to my Facebook page, and I'm using mini chat here. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. When I get hit get started, mini chat's going to ask me for an email address. So I'm going to put info at thinkvon.com, and then mini chat's going to then respond back to me and say, "Hey, thanks for your email. Can I have your phone number?" So I'm going to give a phone number: eight one two eight two zero five 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 seven. And I'm going to give that phone number. So now Minichat is going to go in and respond back out to me and tell you thank you and give me some questions. So now I'm going to come in and look at this Minichat list. And I should see that John Vaughn right there with info at Think Vaughn, 812-820-5557. That is that phone number. That was just in took. So you can see how this Zapier integration works. This Zapier integration allows you to get leads from pretty much anywhere that Zapier allows you to get leads from. So you can just look at Zapier. You can get leads from Google Forms. You can get leads from Google Forms, Google Contacts, Google Docs, Google Spreadsheets. You can get leads from your CRM. You can get leads from WordPress, WooCommerce. So you can look and see I've got another list in here somewhere actually i think i deleted it so um you can go in and get leads from you can go in and get leads whenever they're coming in from you your woocommerce store from your shopify store from your magento store from facebook you can get leads from anywhere with this zapier integration so now you know how the zapier integration works and how to set it up so that's the end of this video